All right, music fans, uh, welcome back. Harmless Dave here talking real music in real time for some real people out there just like you and just like me. Uh, music legend, guitar legend Carlos Santana has collapsed during a Michigan concert. This was an outdoor venue. I know it's Michigan, but we're talking July heat and probably July humidity, even in the state of Michigan. Medical personnel attended to Santana amid a bout with heat exhaustion and dehydration, according to his team. The music legend, I guess, is feeling better. Um, officials from the Detroit-based news affiliate WDIV said that the 74-year-old guitar great collapsed on stage at the Pine Knob Music Theater, <laughs> formerly the DTE Energy Music Theater, an outdoor amphitheater in Clarkston, some 40 miles northwest of Detroit. Yeah, it, it had to be fairly uh, warm out there. And if you've watched Carlos perform, you know that he puts every ounce of his being into playing his guitar. He is one of the best guitar players in the world still. Uh, that's just my humble opinion. Um, according to the television station, medical personnel took to the stage around 10 p.m. local to attend to Santana and officials said he continued to receive medical attention. That was 10 p.m. local time, I meant to say. Uh, Roop Raj, Evening anchor and reporter, boy, they're really just uh, making the story about the anchor at Fox 2, posted a photo of what appears to be Santana receiving medical attention on stage. Medical personnel uh, were uh, crowded around him. Uh, people in the audience were asked to pray for him because of a serious medical issue. That's where things get a little bit sort of different. I don't know. A short time later, social media users shared footage from the concert that appeared to show Santana waving to the crowd while being wheeled off the stage in a stretcher. Uh, the TV station confirmed that Santana indeed regained consciousness after collapsing, although the show did not continue after that point. Yeah, that would be kind of a bad idea. Santana was taken to the emergency department at nearby McLaren Clarkston facility for observation and has been feeling better. The show for tomorrow at the pavilion at Star Lake in Burgettstown, Pennsylvania will be postponed to a later date, according to Carlos's manager. The music legend uh, has been on the road for his miraculous Supernatural 2022 tour. Keep in mind, Carlos Santana is 74 years old. He's on tour with Earth, Wind & Fire in support of his 26th and latest studio album entitled Blessings and Miracles. He's also fresh off a performance for CNN's star-studded The Fourth in America special. Does anybody watch CNN? I'm thinking that they probably could have booked him a more high-profile television uh, network so people would actually watch it. Who's going to watch CNN for 4th of July America specials and coverage? That's just not really a good idea. I'm not saying Fox News is that much better, but at least, you know, they're kind of known for celebrating America. Anyway, uh, that's the story. This doesn't appear to be anything weird, although Something about a medical condition in there, people can speculate. Maybe something is contributing to his issues here. Um, you put a 74-year-old man up on stage for a good couple of hours, hour and a half, whatever, and there's a good possibility in this weather that he might succumb to the conditions in addition to the fact that he's a very um, robust and vigorous guitarist. So um, I don't know. Uh, it, this is one of those things where how about you book an indoor venue? How about that? Air conditioning. The other day I did this video about the stadium tour and how you know people are just roasting outside. Um, you've got the main performer here apparently having the same issue. So 
Again, our thoughts and our prayers, by the way, Carlos asked for prayers, which is nice. I hear a lot now that people won't say the word prayers. They'll say our condolences, our thoughts. We're thinking about you uh, as if, you know, praying is a stupid idea and it's just hocus pocus. Well, um, yeah, maybe it is for some of you, but here's the deal. Pray for Carlos Santana that he's okay. He specifically asked for you to pray for him. And uh, maybe, you know, um, pray for the manager of uh, his crew that uh, maybe uh, they'll, they'll pick a better way to showcase his talents. I know in the summer, you've got these amphitheaters and outdoor venues and people think, oh, it's charming. It's wonderful as you're being attacked by mosquitoes and um, every day is a bad hair day, right? Because you're in the midst of humidity here in uh, the middle of summer, right? Right smack dab, kind of at the beginning of summer, actually. But um, when you think of the first week of July, you're thinking of pretty extreme conditions out there. No matter where you are in the United States, you can hit at least 95 degrees, maybe higher. So again, kind of an exercise in common sense to say, maybe Carlos, maybe he should play the indoor venues, right? Maybe that would be better for him, especially if they already know he has some sort of underlying health issues. But uh, we shall see. The next gig is canceled and hopefully he'll be back on his feet and playing that guitar like nobody else because he is an original. Nobody plays uh, quite like Carlos Santana. All right, people, that's the video. Don't forget to support the channel. New month, looking for some new patrons. We had a couple folks coming on board in the last two or three days. But as always, I need your support during these months as people are doing uh, summertime stuff and uh, the economy is really bad out there, which I completely understand why a dollar a month to this guy. I don't know, uh, because you like the content, you want to support the channel. That's all I can say, you know, uh, but I appreciate everybody who supports. Uh, I think about you guys every single day for helping me out. And uh, thanks again, and I will see you soon.